right now I'm just uh, searching for references poses of because I need to draw a uh, some kind of a Roman soldier so I'm trying to find a good pose Finished pa siya pero hapit na po nga moment kanina na yung lighting and then i-render na lang yung ang pan i-finalize na lang yung ang details mga kind details like the armor My name is Carlo Oshir and I am a freelance illustrator and concept artist. I am Ken Hadukana, digital illustrator. I do mainly character designs. I take uh, textual descriptions for fantasy characters, for games and novels to create uh, an, um, visual artworks. Clients ask me to design or bring their characters to life. They give me their um, descriptions and pictures on what they want their character to look like and add my um, creativeness. So, ako siyang i-drawing and then ako din siyang i-paint. Uh, my creative process starts with a brief. Magatag ang client o descriptions and uh, references. Uh, sometimes ang client is specific on what they want. When the client sends me a character sheet, narito ang name, narito ang appearance sa character na dapat akong drawing, uh, narito ang, let's say, pose o kung say, yang characteristics and sometimes uh, vague kay lang um, description so ila kong inan nga i have uh, creative freedom over their character magsugod na din ko o ko conceptualize o sketches after the sketch they come back to me to, to uh, give their feedback on what i did right and what i did wrong kung asa dito nga sketches sa akong nga akong provide makita sa client as I ganahan, mo rin to akong inainayan o improve. So from sketch, ako din siyang i-line art. Makita na po sa client. So it's a collaborative process. Then, kung may feedback, incorporate na ako. Then, add some things to their character and whatnot. And after that, if they need it colored, then... colors na yun. And then, final rendering line. So, at, it, at each of those stages, ipakita na sa client kaya parang uh, wala revision dito at the, at the final output. And sometimes, they want uh, back, background behind their characters as well. So, sa additional charges as well. Wala standard pricing sa platform, pero gi-research na ako ni based sa prices sa other artists around the world. Kuhan po, gi-base po sa level of Koan, level of quality. And sa platform na mga ginagamit, kainaan na siya daan, nakapackage na. We have a basic, standard, and premium. Then, na rin add-ons. Kadaganan sa akong clientele karon is, koan, uh, from abroad kay online mga kuga work. They're basically just people in the internet. <laughs> and they're, uh, uh, from what I've seen, they're mostly from outside of the country. Mostly U.S. and I think I got some from France and Mexico. Most most of them are foreigners. Foreign because aside sa koan exchange rate kay dako, kanang wala ka yoy art scene dery sa Cagayan de Oro, which is kung asa ko karon. Nahimo siya niche market kay koan man. I work mostly on games o koan fantasy art. So, naamay niche market sa 
sa Fiverr so mo kung gi-target then ang mark ang kana ang market dere sa Cagayan Oro kay eh, wala ba the work that i do is not uh, currently widely used in the Philippines i think and locally in, here in the city i think there's not much and if if, if ever they want to their budget is not as high as the um, foreign clients wala pa kayo games industry dere sa Cagayan so if wala games industry wala kanang local market local nga consumers so wal, wala kay makita nga sales so syempre kita ko sales sa gawas so okay i'm AJ Vangelista and i do freelance work by definition i call myself a social media manager Basically, I provide content for businesses and help them reach their audience through online content. I provide videos, photos, captions, uh, and I even manage their social media accounts. So the process is, it starts with, first of course, is learning the brand. It's important that I have a grasp of, on who the client is, who are their target audience, who are their target market, and uh, what's their story, what's their message, what do they want to tell their um, customers about their brand. Because um, what I do is help them put out their story. When I get like a, a grasp or even the gist of the company or the brand that I'm currently working on, that's when I start to conceptualize, provide provide concepts or marketing strategies that can be used for their brand. After that, ang gagawin na namin is we uh, continue to execution. So as you can see ganina, like I showed na, okay, we can use this content, this kind of content to attract people Let's use this kasi wala pa to sa CBO. After that, it gets approved. Then we execute it. Then I edit. Then finally, provide the output. Then just uh, pray the Hail Mary <laughs> and see if the algorithm will <laughs> ano, pick up. My clients right now are mostly local. I don't have foreign clients as of the moment. And most of them are residing here in Cagayan de Oro. And most of them are into the food business, specifically coffee. Ang ironic is friends ko sila. So, I'm happy and blessed to, to have that kind of um, business relationship with these people. So, how it started? Ano lang, nakita lang nila na ito yung ginagawa ko. They have this problem, they want to to hire someone who would market their so their stuff on social media. And it just so happened at the right moment, I was there and providing na, at, ano lang, simpleng kwentuhan. It started from that, after that, a few months, people are starting to see that there is growth dito sa client ko na hinahawakan. Then, they started to ask the client, paano nangyayari yan? So, that's the reason na meron na rin mga tao na hindi ko kailala who... Um, approached me, sila talaga nag-approach, hindi ako, nag, hindi ako nagmamarket sa sarili ko. Sila yung nag-approach and they want, they, they got me right now. These are from CDO lot. Uh, sa totoo lang, mahirap maghanap ng local client. Kasi here in the Philippines, they devalue our worth for the, as of now. Although, meron naman ang nakakagets ng, ng value ng social media, but hindi pa rin siya ganun ka bale hindi pa ganun ka accepted ng mga tao na feel na ako before nga uh, ubos na ako ng uh, price kit yo labi na gidiri sa local di ba sa foreign clients ako gina charge mga 100 so okay lang na 5k 5k worth tapos kung sa diri mga 25 lang lang ginay ng budget local la diri sa city tapo yung sahay nga ko an kanang wala pa yung output pero Siyempre, maghagal magigit ka or na magin na yung kuhandaan, negosyasyon. 
Mayroon sila nga ingani ra man ingani ra man ang value sa imong artwork kay gi-google na ko ang pag market sa imong value which is high and then i-devalue ra dayon kay gi-google ra gid nila ang image side so, dali-dali on ka kay kuan lagi ka nang dali ra lagi ni drawing on so devalue ya kuno siya so gina-devalue imo ang imong process then sai po ang imong concept isa mo mean now <laughs> Yun, nakaka-devalue siya. Tapos yung yun din, pag may mga creative differences na parang yung mga client pa na hindi marunong mag, magbigay ng <laughs> kung anong gusto nila. So parang ang labas agad is pangit yung gawa mo. Where in fact, hindi lang talaga nila ma... Sila mismo hindi lang mas ma-express ano yung gusto nila. So, hindi naman tayo manguhula. Pag ganun, uh, might as well um, stop the service. Kasi... It's draining mentally, sa and emotionally sa akin, and physically. Kasi kailangan mong i... Kailangan mo palaging parang pag sila yung kausap mo, kailangan mo i-prove yung self mo. Where in fact, meron tao na who's paying more, who values you. So dun ganun lang, di ba? Kesa... Uh, yeah, it's still money. Sa akin pa rin, kliyente pa rin yun. Pero kung hindi talaga ay perfect fit, I feel na marami namang client sa mundo. Whenever a client tries to reach out, I I always try to have a conversation sa moingon mo kung ako niya. I work as I with a team. O na ako kauban mo color, na ko kauban mo mo paint aside sa ako. Ah. It's just it's not just kanang ako arang process, pero na ko koy katabang ani parang uh, mahatag na ko within let's say 7 days or 15 days kada pud paspas gyud ang turn around dili gyud ka dapat langay so gina try na ko og pasabot sila most of the time mo ingon nila ay ngana din na diay so ma ma sell ni mo more ang value sa process og sa artwork specialized work tayo eh specialized yung service na binibigay natin so you can just like compare that on on ano parang ikaw ba ay compare mo ba ang sweldo ng doktor sa minimum wage di ba hindi kasi specialized niya yon successful pwed i can say na hindi pa pero ma, pero malayo na i don't want na parang pumasok siya sa akin oh okay na ako no want to be complacent pero ma thankful na ako na na kahit pa paano malayo-layo na yung narating ng na kung ano man tong ginagawa ko ngayon. Dili ko ga base sa success sa monetary nga kuan nga aspect. Maka-work lang ko sa akong gusto which is kani mag-draw og characters, mag-paint. So, yeah, I can I can see myself nga successful on that aspect. Fulfilling siya kay um I'm doing work that I love. I love to do. Although kapoy gyapon siya but tungod kay ganan ko sa akong ginabuhat ganan ko gaka enjoy bitag ko sa pag pag drawing so enjoy na ako ang work it becomes endurable marelish na ko ang success kay naka work ko ing ani yung wala art industry dere di ba so mao yung gid na ang pinakada ko nga hurdle kay kay giyon sa nimo pag pag strive nga maka work og ing ani nga industry sa sa climate nga walay ing ana nga market like i just call it a blessing pa lang bless lang talaga ako siguro eh nag kasi marami naman nagtatrabaho rin ng na like they're working hard but walang nangyayari i've been there so ngayon nagtatrabaho lang din ako at yun to ano lang like you don't stop kinya ko lang tapos dumating eh, siguro it's just my time ko lang talaga ngayon. Ngayon lang yun eh. Bola lang eh. Paikot-ikot lang yan. So, maybe it's just my time. So, yun lang ang masasabi ko. <laughs> <laughs>